One day, our Holy Prophet وسلم, entered his house and he saw a piece of bread thrown on the floor. Don't we do that? When we finish eating food, you see bread, the leftover is all over and we throw it in the garbage. What did our Prophet do? He saw a piece of bread thrown on the floor. The Holy Prophet took that piece of bread from the floor. He wiped it with his own hand and he ate it. And then he looks at his wife. He says, if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives you a na'ma, a favor, a bounty, and you are not grateful to Allah for that bounty, Allah may take that bounty and give it to some other people and deny you from it. Don't we see now some nations around the world deprived from one decent meal? They cannot have one decent meal. There are millions of people. There are Syrian refugees who are now, now I'm talking to you, passing through Europe, seeking a safe haven, and they cannot find one good meal to eat. They eat, that was in New York Times. They eat grass in Hungary, in, uh, in uh, Serbia, in those countries that they pass through. They eat grass. Alhamdulillah, we do not eat grass. We have to be very grateful to Allah. We cannot spoil the na'ma of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by throwing it in the garbage. If you have left over, give it to the poor people. You do not know poor people, keep it in your refrigerator. And then warm it up afterward and eat it. What's the big deal? Some people tell you, no, I cannot do this. I have to eat fresh food. Who said you have to eat fresh food? There could be a day that you long for food, not fresh food, for food to eat and you can't find. Let's be very appreciative of the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Let's not be so spoiled. I have to eat fresh food and I throw food in the garbage because I will not eat but fresh food. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will hold us accountable for that.